at me and he said, you can do this. I think you're never going to break that kind of comfort zone, comfortable zone limit. And this is where the growth is. The growth is just out there, right? And I can't put myself in that position unless I have someone to help me with me in the journey. And this is what is great about you guys. It's just you managed to get us to go through just above the barrier. So every time we do something, you push up just extra little percenter, extra little percenter. And this is how you grow. This is how you gain. Tim and Jacko uh, put me through many years of pain as my SNC coaches when I was swimming. Yeah, you kind of introduced me to calisthenics and it's something that I've kind of taken with me now into my new sport. I think it's that, I think it's the community side of it and that you and Tim are just, you, you kind of give us a big hug. <laughs> you know, it, it's, it's more like a family um, than, than being, being scrutinised and, and analysed, you know, so um, it feels like everybody's on the, on the same journey, everybody's in it together, wants to progress, wants to uh, be the best version of himself. Just the motivation from being here and mixing with everybody and chatting calisthenics for three days has been great. I think it's a big part of it, meeting other people and seeing where other people are at as well and, know, and helping other people as well in some little ways where we've sort of, we're no experts but we've struggled in some areas and we can kind of correct and other people are correcting us and I think we're all kind of working towards the same goals and that's that's the nice nice thing. I loved it and you know it's something that I've really missed since I've been in the canoeing program you know we've got our own strength and conditioning coaches but I do miss working with you guys and I think you know that you're both very motivating and um, when you, like I say when you're spending a lot of time doing something trying to learn a new skill you need somebody who's teaching you that, who's as passionate as you are about it and as passionate about having fun and being the best that you can be at whatever you're doing and so for me that was really motivating to be around all the time and you know that's what what I wanted out of a strength and conditioning coach you know to, to get that element of fun but know that they knew their stuff motivated me and were having just as much fun as I was. One of the values that resonates to me from the School of Calisthenics is, is honesty. Um, there's no clickbait, there's no, oh, come solve this in five minutes and it'll fix all your problems. You're, you're very honest about, look, you have to put in the work. Um, we'll teach you how to do it. We have a system, we know how to do it, um, but you have to put in the work. There's no quick fixes or anything like that and that really resonated with me. It's such a massive help really um, not just to me but also um, people I teach because straight away I mean a lot of people think no I can't how, how on earth am I going to do that and they don't believe that I actually feel like that or I felt like that before I started following you guys and uh, we all really help each other it's such a supportive community and you know positivity oozes every part of the School of Calisthenics. What I really love doing is coming down to Nottingham to the, to the classes as well. Um, again, such a family atmosphere. It's just an hour of playing and just having fun, you know. So, yeah, it's just brilliant. Your input to everything, that you're kind of really passionate about what you do. It's kind of like you're always, you can be one-to-one -one with somebody if someone's stuck on something. You're really passionate about every single individual that is part of the School of Calisthenics, which I really like. You just can't get that coaching anywhere else. You know, I've, I've travelled over 400 miles to come here, um, specifically for that, because um, your literature for your, your e-books and what I'm seeing and, or listening to in the podcast, and you can tell that you know what you're talking about, being on the, uh, the, the workshop in Edinburgh as well. And every time that you teach, Perhaps it might seem like the same thing for you, but it's always fresh. It's always delivered with passion and enthusiasm, and you just can't get that anywhere. It's just like being part of a family, really. Um, you've, you've made it such fun for all of us, and we all really feel like we're, we're part of something special. It's, it's a friendship, family kind of thing. Um, we all have a, a good laugh and uh, we all support each other along the way. We're all at various stages in our calisthenics journeys, so to speak. It hasn't been intimidating at all. Um, I think you and Tim have been very generous with your time with somebody who's a beginner and everything's been scaled to my abilities. So at no point have I felt that I can't do anything because there's a variation that works for me. 
And I think what they're really good at is breaking things down, whatever pattern it is, really simply and you know, making a series of progressions so you know, they can make it accessible for, for anyone.